uh, a straw and we have to put it right over here and we need some tape okay now we just need to tape it this side and the other side and we need this stick and then we just need to just put it inside the straw in both sizes then we have to do it once again the both sizes one like that and now we need another one and tape it this side Now we need another one, another stick, and place it here, place it here. Now we will put a, a tire over this wheel over here. like that. Done! Now we have to take one plate out and swing it this side. Done. Now the other side. Then, now the, right there, again, we have to put these tires in. We put these, uh, these uh, this tire, this wheel, inside that. Over here. This one over here. Done. Now this side we need to put this balloon. This side in this. Now we need some more tape. Let's go to outside to start our car. Now let's start. So here we use Newton's the law of motion. For every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. When you inflate a balloon and then re uh, release the nozzle, the rubber contracts and pushes the air out the nozzle. This means that there must be an equal and opposite reaction. The air pushes back on the rubber propelling the balloon forward this principle is used in real locks and jacks i hope you like my video bye bye